Herma down to 20% health, only to have her use her Empowered W, heal up to about 50 or 60% health, root me and then get away. She's now healthier than me because she healed so much health. I will need again Executioner's Calling at some point. And as soon as I have money for uh, Vamp Scepter, I need to back and get it. Yeah, Karma's another one. Karma is actually a really high pick ban on the pro scene as well. Really, really high. Not for top lane, but you get the idea. Okay. Ning, I just wanted them to stop. Okay, and what's your point? Like I can now back free. Nice, and she just got some free cash. Oh, cool. Karma didn't get any. All right, that ended up being a win-win. Yep. <laughs> yep. Karma got nothing. Karma got nothing. And hey there, Flutter, or Nido. I will not be denied seeds. Not really. I've got enough healing. I'm okay. She'll be annoying, and that's why I say I want to get the Vamp Scepter as fast as possible, because that's how I can stop her from denying the CS. If anything, I potentially should have actually started um, Longsword uh, Refillable or something weird like that. get that one. Oh, she still got it, but she'll miss that one. And she'll potentially miss, she'll miss that one for sure. That one's gone. Cool. So she will come out behind. I actually need to ward here, because they might have gone and stolen the blue. There's a potential gank from that direction. But as you can see, like, I am so far denying her that's not actually going to be the case for long, because her poke is really annoying and very easy to land. Her skill shots are much easier to land than mine, and she only really has one. And she can empower it to basically make it that if she just aims in the general direction, it'll hit. Imagine if my Q exploded almost instantly. That's essentially what her empowered Q does. She's really, really annoying. But she missed a bunch of farm doing that. I don't mind. It's really annoying, but again, she's cost she's getting kleptoprocs, but costing herself farm and not denying me farm. I think that's the bigger that's the bigger issue here, is that she's not denying me CS. Now I'm getting denied for it. Oh, God damn, I shot the wrong one. Yeah, now I'm falling behind it. Actually, interestingly enough, I'm still ahead in CS. And she's running out of mana. Cheesy fucking strat. Yeah, Karma is one of those champions that you cannot say, I had fun in this lane. Because you can't literally have fun against Karma unless you're shitting on. She's designed specifically to aggravate lane opponents. I feel like that was the core design philosophy behind it. How to make a champion so unfun to play against that it would actually cause people to rage quit if they didn't know what they were doing. 
it does feel like that was like the intent behind the riot design. Although, to be honest, I don't think Riot had any intent in her kit at all. Ugh. That's fine. Come on. Shit. I have to stay now. I don't know why my back got cancelled the first time. I do have my E to keep me alive in case she tries to do something stupid. This time I'll back. Yeah, I managed to block the shot, and now I can freeze. Better than freeze. Let's see if I can stop her from backing. I don't think I hit anything. Uh, I just lost a bunch of life, but I've got my W to heal me back. Thanks, Tom, for the subscription. Jesus, 26 months in a row. I love you, man. I do. Oh, I'm back to full health. That's right, Vamp Scepter. Good. And then she's going to miss farm and XP. I'm actually even in farm with her. That's good. Actually, I'm up in farm. She's spending all of her effort harassing me, and that harassment's going to mean a lot less now. Merc treads against her? Absolutely. It's not the first thing I'm going to buy. First thing I buy is sustain. Sustain allows me to shrug off the fucking harass that she's going to be constantly throwing my way. And then I'm probably going to want Spectre's Cowl, because that will allow me once again to shrug off what she's doing. As you can see, I do a lot of damage. She's almost dead, actually. I could have killed her there. Let's see if she's stupid enough to do that again. I've got Ghost. Well, we got her Flash, at least. up. Use my incredibly cheap W. Unfortunately, I'm out of mana. Fortunately. Damn it. No blast income. Never mind. I can't leave. I'll just use my W to farm under tower. I mean, that's the thing. Karma is a very squishy champion. She builds squishy, too. And this specific Karma is building particularly squishy. Well, not really particularly squishy. She's actually going for Frozen Fist first. Alright, now we get... Boots, MR, Regi. Oh, I think they got her. Yeah, she's definitely dead. And the Karma doesn't have any health or mana. She burned it all, you know, harassing me. Oh, man, I do hope they can get her. She does not have a flash. She's dead. He did get her. Uh... You're running the wrong way, man. Whoa there! Ho oh, ho ho! Oh, that was very rude, Jinx. That was very rude. Very fucking rude. Right, my ult's up and soon I'll be nine. 
That was really rude of the Jinx. I'm very happy they killed her. Yeah, it doesn't really do much damage. It's annoying. Don't get me wrong. It's really, really annoying that it doesn't do much damage. And see, I'm basically healed back up. And I'm almost nine. Once I am, you're going to be sorry. I'm burning too much mana just throwing cues at her. The cues are completely ineffective. Oops. too soon. The turret took too long to fire is actually more accurate. So she's nine, I'm not. But as you can see, like, she isn't doing much damage to me. I heal it back too damn fast. And there, now I'm nine. That's the critical point. This is the point where I can turn things around and kill her. Such an annoying champ. It's just too easy for her to keep you in the sweet spot. The spot where you can't really fight back. Oh, she's dead. Oops! She walked a little too close to the lion's mouth. If I can ever land my E on her now, she's dead. I'm not. Before that wasn't true, but now that I'm 9, I have the sustained damage to actually kill you. You silly girl. All of your fucking antics don't mean a goddamn thing if I can get next to you. You know that moment? Oh god, what movie was that? Uh, fuck, this is gonna kill me. Um, comic book movie, sort of black and white. Oh god, I, it really pisses me off that I don't remember this. But there is a scene in that movie where a really big guy is trying to deal with a small and quick guy. First time the quick guy got him, blinded him, caused him all sorts of trouble. The second time around, he brought handcuffs. He handcuffed his hand to his and said, How you gonna hop around now? That's essentially what just happened here. How are you going to hop around now? Yes, you and what damage, ma'am? That's why we're okay. We got the sustain. We're fine. And now my ult's up again. Which means if I get my greasy mitts on her, she dies. Mm. And there, look at my health. I'm fine. I need to come back, like, right now, Karma. Before I um, do something that you will regret. Oh, good. I'll take the turret then. I have enough time to kill it. I'm not coming to help you. Sorry, Trist. I can take the turret. There's no reason for me to come help Tristana. That turret's worth a lot more gold for our team than one kill. The karma basically threw that away. Oh. I got this. She's dead in five seconds.
Got her. Thanks for the red buff. See, this is the problem. When you play a cheesy champion like Karma Top Lane, and you're up against somebody who really knows what they're doing, your cheese is only as good as you are. And this Karma is apparently showing that she's not very good. Um, I do want Righteous Glory next. Show spell cost. I should do that. Why haven't I done that? When I have a free moment, I'll do that. I should. Ow! Wow. Didn't even get her ult off. Oh, come on. I'm not even going to get any. I didn't get any part of that because my W wouldn't shoot at her. Because her ult knocked her back so my Q missed. Oops. What the fuck is that Nautilus doing? He's swimming. This TF is really uh, pushing his luck here. He's very low. Yes, I'm coming to defend this. Get that stupid blasting cone. Now to get rid of this stupid karma. Hi there. I got some bad news for you, Karma. That's a terrible direction to be running right now. That is an absolutely terrible direction to be running. You're not getting out of this. And my ult now, um, I don't think she'll survive. Hmm. Dang, she will survive long enough to get an execute. No, she won't. Thank you, TF. Thank you. Thank you so much for picking up the, the, the pieces on that one. Thank you. So happy somebody got the gold with that. That would have been really frustrating if I threw my ult away for nothing. My ult actually did get a kill. Not for me, but for TF. Because if I didn't throw my ult, she would have died under that turret before TF could kill her. There we go. So something I've needed to do for a very long time. Thanks for giving me that wonderful reminder. Uh, it's just people tend to remind me not in the game. Or not at all, actually. Or maybe I'm busy or I forget. I have a hundred excuses I'm sure I could use here. I think there's a pink word in here, wasn't there? Nope. That's not good. Well, they traded two for two, actually. That's just fine. I'm not rotating now. There's no point. Better I get their attention top lane or go for a tier two. Two of them are dead. Sending anything less than three for me right now is fatal for them. It's lovely. Yeesh! And we out! And we out! <laughs> I love it. I scared them so much that they they let me run away, essentially. <laughs> Big Boy Ergot is uh, terrifying, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I 
like I said, I wanted to get their attention top lane. And I got their attention top lane. I got a turret, and my team got a dragon. And I also have teleport, which means I will come help you if you need it. This isn't gonna work. Oh, this is not gonna work. Oh god, what have I done? Oh god, what have I done? <laughs> Alright, they still got the turret. Uh, please don't die. Uh, he's dead. He needed to have the gold card locked in before the um, flash went through. Oh well, it's still uh, a turret and a kill. Wait. Yeah, Nautilus died. It's still a turret and a kill for two. She's so dead. Wait, Karma's got no mana. Uh, apparently she has enough mana. Dang. <laughs> apparently she- What the fuck is that? How does she still have mana for spells? This is a mage. Why are her spells cheaper than mine? Seriously, that's fucked up. She's a mage, her spells should be more expensive, not less. Um... Right? Just logically speaking it makes sense that mages should have higher costing spells since there's so many items that give them mana or mana return or just like there are so many items that are clearly good for them. let me stop listening to the bitching hmm We never got Harold. Are you guys okay? Hmm. Hmm. I gotta get out of here. That pink ward doesn't make me feel particularly safe, but there were three bot side. I'm kind of surprised the team didn't take advantage of that. They could have gone for Baron. Now it's not really possible. Alright, she's leaving. I must continue the shove. Because at this point, the karma literally means nothing to me. She cannot kill me 1v1. It requires at least two of them to deal with me. It's unfortunate that she brings so much CC and um, utility that it is it just requires her and another carry. It wouldn't be easy. I'd make it hurt. But they could do it. What the hell is TF doing? Coming through. Coming through! I am hungry! Nice TP from the TF. Very nice. I took huge advantage of it. That's potential. Yes, you guys and what damage? You need to land your skill shots if you want to hurt. And she's dead. Okay then. Nicely done, Vi. I kind of blocked the rest of your team from joining. That'll be inhibitor number two. Uh, team? Any of you guys gonna come help me here? <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> I was just 1v4 there because no one on my team had the balls to come help me. Thankfully, they had the balls to come and clean up the mess. What the fuck? What the hell, team? <laughs> I went full man mode. My team's gone. I, I chunked off at least, what was that, like two or three thousand health amongst the various champions there. If my team were there, it just would have been a fucking slaughter. They just backed away at the worst time.
understandably, I guess, they thought I was going to die. Personally, you know, actually, I don't blame them. If I were in their shoes, I think I would have felt the same way. Um, like, this Urgot's going 1v4. There's no way he's going to come out ahead. That's, like, I, you know what, I do agree with that philosophy, that thought process. I mean, I'm big, I'm strong, but how are they to know that I was that big? And now I've got my three items. That's the crazy part. This was before three items. Now that I have three items, um, oh yeah, I should go get the dragon. Yeah, Cloud Drake does a lot of damage for some reason. Like, I've got Death's Dance Cleaver and Armor, and I'm still actually losing health. That's ridiculous that I lost as much as I did. The Cloud Drake did, like, almost a thousand damage to me. Through the healing. Yeah, the team needs to come bot side. Top and mid are just pushing on their own. We win by default if we simply come as a team bot lane. I don't know what the Chiana is doing. She should be with us. Oh! Fuck, that Oriana does a lot of damage. Jesus, she's so low. Just Siege, I mean, the Supers are coming in. These guys need to back... Oh, what the... What is she... Huh. Works. I guess. Oh my god, he was dead before my ult could hit him. No, the healing. The healing! And the... Wow, oh, thank you, Lulu. The Lulu ult plus the healing I got from the death stance saved me there. Holy shit! Uh -oh. <laughs> I ran past him. <laughs> Alright, one on one. I guess uh, it's a coin flip on whether I'm gonna climb a rank here. Um... Actually, sh fuck, I should've given it to the Lulu. That ult did save me. 6, 5, 10, 3, 1, 4. 13, 1, 4. Okay, no, I honored the right person. Oh, I definitely honored the right person. Wow. Cool. Uh, yeah, so I do want a reporter. She was bitching a lot. I think other people were too, but I, I didn't notice specifically who. Uh, 